Hi, I'm Zana Van Dyke, and today I'm going to take you through a full body low impact workout using no equipment. So let's get started with a cheeky little warm. This is going to be short and sweet. You're going to stand at the back of your mat. You're going to walk out into a high plank. Drop your hips towards the floor, look towards the sky. Lift the hips, walk the calves back, and then walk your hands back in. Give me two more of those. So you're going to walk out, high plank, drop the hips, lift the hips, and then walk back in. On this last one, we're going to stay at the bottom. So you're going to walk out for me. We're going to drop those hips, lift the hips, and then bring that right leg forward, drop the left knee to the ground, and twist. So down to the ground, twist through, and one more. Nice, back to high plank, bring that left leg forward, drop the knee, and twist. You might get a little crack here, enjoy it. Good guys, give me one more. This is a very short, very sweet workout. If you want to add in more of a warm up, I feel you. Right, legs out to the side, knees a little bit wider than hip width. You're just going to drop each hip down to the ground. Again, you might get a cheeky little click here. Enjoy the click. The click is our friend, okay? Right, give me two more. And last one, come to standing. A little bit of an upper body workout. What we're gonna do is just firstly pull that knee up, go for an arm circle on that side, switch sides. Knee up, release the glute, arm circle. Oh. Get that body moving, feel that heart rate slowly starting to lift. Give me one more each side. And we're gonna be nice and warmed up. And we're gonna jump in to our circuit. Guys, this is beginner friendly. It's gonna be low impact. I will show you modifications when appropriate. And we're gonna start with a squat and punch. So you're gonna squat down. And you're gonna come up, twist and punch the opposite side. Down, twist. Choose a pace that's appropriate for you. You can push as hard as you like. You can go a little bit slower. And in your rest periods, I'll show you the next exercise. So in 10 seconds time, guys, we're going to jump into that squat and punch. So knees a little bit wider than hip width. We're going to squat down in three, two, one. Let's go. Squat, twist. Squat, twist. Nice, guys. Push those knees out on every rep. Awesome. Twisting through that core, coming onto the toe of the leg that you're twisting away from and down. Nice. 20 seconds here. If you want to pick up the pace, you can. Let's go, 15. Get into a nice little rhythm. Knees out, heel lifting. Every single rep for five seconds. Three, two, one. Rest for 20 while I show you your next exercise. You're going to come to the back of your mat, walk out, high plank, four mountain climbers, and walk back in to standing. We're going in seven seconds. All comes around very quickly, doesn't it? Right, <laughs> three, two, one, bring it down to the floor, walk it out. High plank, switch it on. Four cross body mountain climbers, walk it back up, stand, squeeze the glutes. Nice. Let's get into a rhythm, out and up. Good, engage that core, bring that bum all the way down, squeeze it in on every rep and bring it back up. Good, coming into your final 10 seconds here. Can you give me one more rep guys? Stick with me for three, two and one. Right, next up, come to the front of your mat, you're going to reverse lunge, tap the ground, knee drive, elbow to knee, switch sides, like so. Alternating, side to side, Whew. deep breath, three, two, one. As you go down, back knee taps the ground, come up, elbow to knee tap, engage the core, good. 30 seconds, woo, keep your balance. Nice. Deep breath, take your time. Really focus on loading this front leg, pushing through the front heel to engage that glute. 
Nice. 10 seconds here. We've got a spicy a little for body one. All right. Three. One more rep. Rest. Okay, onto the ground. Oh, this one's nasty, okay? We're gonna show you modification. You're gonna come onto your plank position. Down, down, up, up. Alternating the arm that you lead with. I'm sorry, okay? Three, <laughs> two, one. So if you're advanced, do it like so. If you're a beginner, this is beginner friendly. Come onto your knees. Keep that nice straight line. Knees, hips, shoulders. Go down and up. This will still work your core. This will still work your upper body. But it'll take some of that strain out of your shoulders. Okay, so that's the beginner friendly version. If you're feeling spicy, bring it up. Good. Last five. Three, two, one. Okay, come into your final exercise of this circuit, a little lower body one. So you're gonna go curtsy lunge, squat, curtsy lunge. All right, so it's gonna really feel it deep into the glutes. So, three seconds, two, one, back knee taps to the ground. In that squat position, chest proud, back knee taps to the ground. So that curtsy lunge, you're going back at a 45 degree angle on every rep. Nice. Woo! Curtsy lunges are so good for burning into those glutes, but he's strengthening your posterior chain. Stay with me. Woo! I love how I named this beginner friendly low impact and I'm here like, ah, I'm dying. It's good though. I'll like to sweat with you guys. And rest. Okay, into your first exercise. Again, for round two, final round, squat, and a cross body punch. So, feel a bit wider than hip width, toes pointing out, you're ready to squat down, punch through, no excuses now. You know the exercises. Let's go. Use that core, rotate through on every rep. Stay with me, stay strong. Squeeze those glutes at the top, twist through, lift that heel of the opposite leg to the arm that is crossing. Good. You are in round two and you're smashing it. Come on. Let's go for seven seconds. Keep going all the way to the end. Three, two, one. To the back of your mat. Walk out for mountain climbers. Woo, we're gonna target upper body and core right here. So, you know what you're doing now, guys. Make sure that core is switched on every single rep, really burning into those shoulders. In five seconds, three, two, one. Let's go. Down to high plank. Two, four, and walk back up. Stand tall, squeeze the glutes, good. Down to high plank. Four, up, squeeze the glutes. Now, if your hamstrings are tight, don't be afraid to bend your legs as you come back in. If you've got hamstring flexibility, hinge forward from the hips and walk out with nice straight legs. All right, so modify based on your flexibility. In three, two, and one. Guys, are you sweating? I'm sweating. Next up, we have got reverse lunge knee drive. Cheeky little lower body burner, working into those glutes. Reverse lunge, drive that knee through in four seconds, guys. Join me in three, two, one, and twist. And lift, good, engage that core. Nice. Woo, get into that rhythm, get into that flow. Feel that burn, engage those glutes. Really twist through the core, get that elbow all the way to the knee on every single rep. Awesome work, guys. 15 seconds here. 
You are so close to completing this workout. Full body burn. Just stick through all the way to the end. Three, two, one. Ooh, right, down onto the ground. We have got commandos up and down. Again, that is that beginner friendly option on your knees. Maybe start on your hands, drop to your knees. Go with me. In three, two, one. Down and up. Make sure on every rep, you're alternating the leading arm. Try and make sure your core isn't doing this. Hips don't lie, all right? We're keeping them nice and strong. If this is too much, there is always the beginner friendly option. Want to make it easier for yourself? Knees wider. Want to make it harder? Knees closer together, challenges your core more. Good. Four, five seconds. And rest. Guys, whew, we made it. One more exercise. Let's do this together. Stay strong all the way to the end. Curtsy lunge to squat. Let's move through it for 40 seconds. In five, three, two, one. Back knee taps the ground. Squat and opposite side. Nice. Perfect, guys. Let's do this. Final push. Take that back knee all the way down to the ground. Really focus on that range of movement, that range of motion on every element of this exercise. Chest proud. Squeeze those glutes at the top. Good, this is it. You're killing it. Seven seconds. All the way to the end. Two, one. Rest. Oh, you guys absolutely smash it. Let's just do a quick stretch. Just a couple of minutes, just a couple of minutes. So roll down onto your back, pop your right ankle on your left knee, reach through, either grab the back of the left thigh and just pull that knee towards you. Feel that stretch in the glute and hamstring of the bent leg here. Good guys, hold it for five, for four, for three, for two, and for one, switch sides, left ankle on the right knee, reach through, either grab the back of the thigh, front of the shin, depending on your flexibility, and hold it here for me for five seconds. Come on, three, two, one. Just seated, just gonna pop your both legs down to one side, and then lay back, feel that stretch through the top quad, if you can't get all the way back to the floor, guys, you can stay up here. Wherever you feel that pull coming through the front quad, just hold it here. Chill, relax. We earned this. Oh, this is nice, isn't it? All right, opposite side, flip it over, lay back. If you feel enough of a stretch in this position, stay here. If not, all the way down to the ground. Try and get this hip on the ground to really feel that stretch. Good guys, hold it for four, for three, for two, and one. We have one last stretch that we're gonna do. Just gonna work into that upper body. So we're gonna bring up the arm, take it over, push down on the elbow. We're gonna stretch into that tricep, but then from here, we're also gonna lean over. Feel that stretch extend all the way down into your lats. Hold it here for me guys, for five, four, three, two, and one, switch sides, opposite arm, lift that chin nice and proud, and lean. Good, hold it for four, for three, for two, and for one. Thank you so much for joining me for today's workout. You guys smashed it, and hopefully, I'll see you in another one very soon.